quick teardown, very quick teardown, this uh, Casio FX82C from the Gram Kekletos Gram bag as it is in very bad condition and not that interesting I will uh, make a teardown of it they did uh, scratch their name at the back and so on because in fact the uh, way it is made is very interesting it is really cost cutting so I did already remove the other screws but there is a plastic cover and in fact there is almost nothing inside you can see the place for two batteries here there is only one uh, film flex PCB and one uh, LCD display here of course and the main clip guys look at this it is a clip on film it is not even potted I can see you will not show you will be able but I can see the bonding wires so it is really made to a cost quite uh, incredible I believe all these series of Casio calculators are almost the same inside uh, one interesting thing about the keyboard in fact the keys press on the film but the contacts the graphite carbon contacts here are actually at the back side and the matching contact pads are on the rear side of the calculator the rear panel I was not expecting that it is quite uh, odd so I will try to remove so uh, it seems that the common issues with the calculators will be either bad uh, contacts uh, in the keys or bad uh, contact with uh, LCD I have another one with uh, which uh, works it turns on but some uh, LCD uh, parts of LCD are not uh, turning on because uh, you know, if you flex a little bit the calculator sometimes they turn on so it seems we have bad contacts happening uh, back there we we'll just have uh, overlay here uh, as you can see it is really easy to repeat really uh, delicate thing and I do not think you can make anything to repair it if there is a bad uh, lost uh, contact uh, in here so it is all what we have I will probably keep this part for the just for the where the IC maybe I will cut around no need to keep this uh, flex I never see it it is really really interesting well, at least uh, never see one not uh, potted with some uh, protection. And the uh, even uh, word, more word is that the batteries, if the user wants to replace the batteries, which is unlikely to happen because they have a 10 years lifespan, but if you want to access the batteries, you will need to remove the, the cover and you will be given access to this very very delicate part but uh, the original batteries are given for 10 years of light of time so as they are mainly school calculators probably the calculator will be ruined way before the batteries are depleted here we have the uh, gummy uh, cups thing quite dirty and the keys which are now loose as you can see, anyway, I will not keep this. I will keep the uh, filter over the um, LCD because it is always uh, interesting and handy to play with. And uh, the battery contacts maybe can be reused. So it is the end of the line for this one, sadly. Nice uh, foam piece under the LCD to keep it uh, pressed in position, it seems. And there was a battery leak in this uh, one. It was uh, not. Uh, it did clean pretty well, but uh, okay. So this was the interesting part. Really made to a, a budget. Not badly made, but they could at least uh, do something better here. And it seems quite. Uh, this tracks uh, carbon tracks seems uh, somewhat uh, delicate. 
also not maybe the best uh, reliability ever. Okay, so thanks for watching. Bye.